not so disappointed with the result. And I think there was aspects of the game we, we played really well. I expect we're going to be one of the top teams in the league. I think we showed today that we can compete and you know, over the course of the season we expect to be there or thereabouts with them. So a few positives. Obviously disappointing not to get three points at the start of the season, but it now means we go to the midweek game at Forest Green and then Blackpool next week to try and get ourselves going. The first one for me is probably a yellow card. I think then the referee gets influenced at half time and then getting swarmed by the players and you know for me he crumbles after that and he gives a red card, evens things up. So the most disappointing thing for me is that we, we let ourselves get into that situation where you know we had eleven v ten and we let them break in the counter attack, you know, we should have stopped that. The ball goes in, we have some good play and it comes out and we regain it really quickly. Uh, and then they, they you know, they nick it and they get away on the counter attack and they score the goal, which again is disappointing. But it's something we work, we can work on. But the fact that we competed really well, you know, we competed against, like I said, a, a top team in this league that, that have just been relegated, that you know have a, a huge budget uh, with ex Premiership players in it. So we know that we we can compete in that. I think the relationship between the players will get better, and we have a lot of changes over the summer as we play more games, as we train more. We will we'll get a better relationship and understanding of how they want to play. The season does not won or lost in the first game of the season. There's a long way to go, but I'm very positive for the players we brought in, uh, and I'm very excited about this season for us. And we're still working on that. You know, and we're hopeful that you know, at some point in this week, hopefully, we can get that one over the line. But it's one we've been working for a long time on. Um, as I said before, we're still looking to recruit. The window is still three and a half, four weeks away, so there's plenty of time to do it and you know, we're working hard as Andy Cullen is myself and the, the recruitment staff.